Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're going to talk about a veteran cryptocurrency project that's been in the market since to October 2011, two years after the launch of Bitcoin and has been around ever since, surviving numerous bear cycles. But the question is, what is next for Litecoin? Now, so for those of you that don't know too much about this project, I'll briefly go over it. So the cryptocurrency for payments based on blockchain technology. So that's what Litecoin is setting out to be, a cryptocurrency for payments. Now, <clears throat> if we scroll, scroll right down to the bottom of the page, it will say here, the Litecoin blockchain is capable of handling higher transaction volume than its counterpart, Bitcoin. Due to more frequent block generations, the network supports more transactions without a need to modify the software in the future. As a result, merchants get faster confirmation times while still having the ability to wait for more confirmations when selling bigger ticket items. Now, of course, this sounds good. It all sounds good. You can also, I would suggest you all look through the website yourself, etc. But a few questions have to be asked, right? If Litecoin is setting out to be a, a currency or a cryptocurrency for payments, then we do know at some point price will probably have to stagnate and become less volatile because volatile currencies do not make good but they don't make good for transactions or day-to-day or -day payments. And the reason why should be quite obvious, right? So for example, with Bitcoin, that's essentially what Bitcoin set out to do as well from the start, but then it changed and, and now has become the store of value. What does that mean? So from a centralized perspective in a centralized world, a store of value would be gold, right? Something that people like to park money in and see it as a safe, haven for their capital and should see appreciating value over the time. That's what Bitcoin has become for the cryptocurrency space, right? Now, like going back to the point, why is volatile uh, currencies n not good? It, there, here's a reason that you should all understand. Let's say um, you wanted to buy a coat, right? Let's just say a 250 dollar coat because that's the current price of bitcoin at the moment so this coat or jacket depending on where you are in the world cost 250 dollars and you were to pay the merchant 200 one litecoin for that coat right or jacket now let's say two hours later price that that litecoin that you sent goes up by 30 percent or let's just say doubles in value although that's good for the merchant it's not good for you as the as the buyer. Why? Because essentially you've given up almost 30 to 100% of potential value, of potential gains essentially, which means you could have bought two jackets for the price of one Litecoin, right? Which is why Bitcoin slowly stopped becoming a means for transactions because essentially you could make, you know, you, you could make more money just holding it than trading it, right? And that is something that we must be very wary about when we look at Litecoin as a project. Now, I do believe this project is definitely gonna be here to stay, and it looks like we will hit all-time highs sooner rather than later. So for example, we had a nice day trade here over in Crypto Crew Premium, link in the description. Nice percentage gain, as you can see, price is broken, through structure. Some of our members are trailing this. And we have, let's just do the maths, about 65%, so 66% to all time highs. This could easily be a 600 to $750 coin by the end of this cycle, even more, right? But the question is, at what, at what point will price start to stagnate, right? That's a discussion for another day. But the question is, will Litecoin moon? Does Litecoin have the potential to be one of the biggest gainers over this last two months, like other coins that we've spoken about on this channel, ICP, etc.? The question to that is yes. Now, before I continue with this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, click the bell notification icon so you can stay up to date on all my recent videos. Remember guys, nothing that you've seen in this video is financially advice. So always, always, always make sure to do your own independent research. Pause the video, click the link in my description and join the Telegram group because that's where you'll be able to stay up to date on all our latest updates, news updates, technical updates, and much, 
much more. Now, let's continue with the video. So what would I be looking to do now? Number one, just because Litecoin is one of the only coins, uh, especially the veteran projects to really take off this year, this is something that I would immediately be adding to my watch list and I would own minimum one of these projects. And that's because who knows how far this will climb. This could potentially end up being like a Bitcoin situation. Why? This coin only has a max supply of 84 million. The total supply is already, so the max supply is already, in, uh, sorry, the total supply is 84 million. Circulating supply at the moment is 68.9 million. This has the potential to at least hit 10,000, in the short, I'd say mid, short, midterm, $5,000 per coin or more, right? So I would definitely be keeping a close eye on Litecoin because if Bitcoin is the silver of the cryptocurrency, sorry, if Bitcoin is the gold standard of the cryptocurrency space, Litecoin could actually end up being the silver of the cryptocurrency space. And in fact, has just, I making this video has actually, yes, that's it guys, eureka moment. The Litecoin is the silver of the cryptocurrency space. I'm making a bold prediction now, and I believe before the end of 2022, one Litecoin will be worth no less than $5,000 per coin. This is going to be an absolute monster. I think this is a silver. Ethereum is not the silver of the cryptocurrency space. Um, that's in a league of its own. Um, you know, I wouldn't really compare that to Bitcoin, but Litecoin can be compared to Bitcoin. And I believe this is the silver of the cryptocurrency space. So I hope you watched this video till the end and I hope you got that aha moment just like I did. Um, this is going to do incredible uh, numbers um, over the short term. So guys, as always, no matter what you do, make sure you seize the day. I'll speak to you all soon. Uh, and of course, make sure you like, comment and subscribe. And if you want more leverage trades like this, um, you know, make sure you join Crypto Crew Premium today. Link in the description. Seize the day, guys. Seize the day.